first team Atlanta Hawks, their New Year's resolution is to trade John Collins. I think they've been, t- they've been talking about that shit for so long. They he doesn't want to be there. They keep fit. complaining. Like I think they just got to move him and 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 get on with it. This to be honest, skill set is like let me weird, say this: though. trading Collins does it really help? <laughs> does it really help that team? Is it Push from get? where they are. Is he helping right now? Like. <laughs> It's still gonna be mid, but like it, it just causing turmoil. Like the fact that he's there and doesn't even act like he doesn't play like he wants to I, be there. He's unsatisfied uh, with his role. Yeah, you I mean, paid him but, a fuck ton of money and dude, he's not living him, up to it. But you're not gonna get something that's gonna help you in games right now, in my opinion. I think my New Year's resolution for that team would be to let Nick McMillan resign or just go change the culture up again. Too much turmoil with him and the superstar. Superstar is gonna win at the end of the day. Yeah, what's up Make with it him? Faster. Why, what? what? Beef? Yeah, they got beef with each other. Apparently, they said that Yo. Nate McMillan was considering uh, and like leaving the job before the season ended. That's how bad it's right now. I mean, he's oh, gone. Wait, wait, he's wait, gonna Nate, be the first person. Like, like beefing? yeah, Nate and uh, Trey. They, uh, oh, Nate and Trey. Got yeah, yeah. Not, yeah. not, not Collins. Nate I mean, and Trey. Who if if they got Nate? a if they got a scapegoat, he's the first person. Like, yeah, hundred percent. I I'd say you make it sooner than what it is if you want to prepare the season. But right now, it's looking kind of done, bro. Not looking dumb, but they're not looking like they're a contender. How's Murray been playing? He's been good. But Trey Young, like, doesn't he doesn't look like he wants to adapt to playing with these new pieces. Like he wants to just do Trey Young still. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't look like crap doesn't work for him. He's not like that's what makes Curry so good. That he could get like other players. But that's just his play style. Other players are just different play styles. Like Lucas right now, he's winning. The problem with Trey though is like he doesn't it doesn't look like when I watch him play, like he's playing the same way, even though they have different pieces. Like he doesn't he doesn't want to adapt to fit to help the team. Yeah, exactly. Like Steph will like adapt like to get his players involved. Mm -hmm. Like he'll take a step back. He did with uh, Kevin Durant. Very he lets Poole do his thing if he's cooking. Trey Young said, I'm gonna get mine no matter what. Like fifty if he needs. It's a usage thing that doesn't work. It's like he tries to be Harden or Luca heliocentric type of thing, but it's not comparing to wins. So like well, maybe really that's good. part of the coaching because if I don't think if if McMillan can't hold Trey Young accountable, that might be part of the problem. Because yes. like if Trey Young's like getting in beef with him and, and he's not respecting the coach, like that's a sign that okay, like you gotta switch it up. You can't have your coach like you can't have your star player and your coach colliding because that's a hundred percent. You're not going to win a championship yeah. that way. And then the year that they made it to the Eastern Conference Finals too, Trey was not ball dominant at all. Like he was passing it around and getting other people involved. Yeah, and Ooh. that's why Collins was playing yeah, well. Capella was, like was playing well. Hunter yeah, was he, playing. He well. averages a lot of assists yeah, yeah. regardless. He's a good playmaker, but like but usage based type of thing. Get your like, stats. Boom. You know, I'm, I remember his assist. Like that was like the first year they. Boomed. Like I remember he went so with Nate like, McMillan. Yeah, they fired the head coach and Nate took over. But that I was know, a honeymoon like, phase, though. So now it's I over. Have a question. Uh, do you guys think that Trey would be an all-star this year? Probably. He's still putting up the numbers. I think there's way too many. We'll get to our all-star list, but I think there's too many uh, pieces. 